when BB called to tell me that blessing was getting married because last year no such news none and then this year oh this girl's getting married this guy's getting married it's like a trend now and i don't know just <laughs> i'm sorry it's not funny no i'm just not like <laughs> Oh gosh, I almost forgot. What? You remember I do? The guy we ran into at the mall two weeks ago. Mm -hmm. He's getting married this weekend. And I set an alarm for a week before. Now I'm just seeing it. Told it's trending. <laughs> <laughs> so what if I ran into him sometime after the wedding? Wow, well, um, you're going with me. Who? You? <laughs> me? No. You were invited, not me. Okay. I know, and I'm extending the invite to you. Mm -mm. No, no, you have to go with me. I mean, to be the woman by my side. You know, the bell on my arm. You know how it is. <laughs> okay. I won't force you if you don't want to go. It's a wedding, so so many cream chicks, you know. I could just make my pick on the bounty. Louis. Yeah, baby. Don't make me go to that wedding with AK-47 on both arms. <laughs> well, you just told me you wouldn't be coming. Mm -hmm. Hey, don't spoil my market. Which market? You're not on any market, so you're mine. See, you're still ticklish, I know. Let me get that. No, I'd rather you didn't. Come do the tickling. Let me get that. Hey, Alfred. Good, Look you. at you, you're glowing. <laughs> <laughs> of course she would glow if she was my woman. Come here, babe. Whoa, Sit. what's up, bro? I'm good, and how are you? Man, I'm okay. I'm great. <laughs> Whoa, now what's up? How is your weekend folding? Oh, great. With her by my side. <laughs> Aha, Alfred. You remember Edo? Edo, Edo. Edo, oh, um, Edo, the guy I met at the office, right? Your school friend. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. what about He's it? getting married this weekend. Sent me an invite and I'm extending to the both of you. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, not too bad. All I need to do is tell him I'm bringing company. That's, that's great. <laughs> that's wonderful. That's great. Oh, man. Go, go rock that party. Uh, you know how it is. <laughs> <laughs> but damn, marriage. <laughs> Man, I'm selling off that deal as soon as I find the woman worth that sacrifice. Alfred, do you mind if I get you something to drink or an extra glass? Oh, oh you know what? That would be nice. Yeah. That would be nice. Okay. Feel free. Oh, right. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> she's nice. <laughs> she's, um, she's well mannered. Yeah, that's how we are excusing us. No kidding? She doesn't listen to men talk, you know. She gives me my space when grown men are talking and all that and all that. Oh, that's great. Whoa. <laughs> She's nice. Yeah, she is. Where did you find her so I don't mind taking a break from work and, you know, go and search for mine? Okay, at the mall. The mall? With a price tag. With a price tag? How much? Uh, uh. Oh, uh, 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 my friend, get a rookie. <laughs> you are not here. <laughs> hey. Uh. You lost. What is it? <sighs> Problems or solutions? Decision. Decision. That's interesting. <clears throat> sure. Um, it's Ruth. Rose. She's good, right? Yeah, she's good. You know, you know what? She's good, right? <laughs> Why are you asking me that? 
I need your opinion. Rose is a nice girl, isn't she? Wait, wait, wait. If you think you're too old for her... Oh, come off it. I've seen 20-year-olds get married to 70-year-olds. Yes. That is it. Marriage. Go for it. Really? Mm-hmm. Hey, babe. Can you come over to the house? Yeah. you walk through this door, I promise to be your knight in shining armor. I promise to fight for you, to love you duly and respect you. I may not be a perfect man, but with you beside me, I, I promise to be better. Please marry me. Thank you, thank, thank you very much. Oh, God. Cheers to a life of bliss. Cheers. Please, you've made me so happy. I can shit rainbows right now. <laughs> Okay, um, 
Let's get started with the food. <laughs> Make everything sound like business. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, you prepared this yourself? Yes, I did. I am marrying the perfect man. Ah, now my head is spinning. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you, madam? Eh? <laughs> That's good news. Great news. Definitely, definitely we're seeing tomorrow. What time are you coming? Good. Yeah, just call me as soon as you arrive. In fact, I have a huge surprise for you. <laughs> Okay, not to worry, not to worry when you come. All right, keep in touch. Sure, sure. Yeah, yeah, touch her, not to you. <laughs> Get out of my phone. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> wow, that was Terry. Oh, your best friend? Yeah, she's coming to town tomorrow, and I think it's a good time for you both to meet. She's really a nice person. Well, finally, a face to the name Terry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm coming for you to meet Tana too. My best friend, the one I said is in the States. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I just pray she can make it for our wedding. Hmm. Okay, so you said Terry is coming in by noon? Yes, by noon tomorrow. What does she like to eat? Let me prepare something for her. Uh, don't bother. I don't think she would want to stress you. I insist. She must eat something in our house. <laughs> okay, then. Make her... Make her a sauce with snails. She'll kill for that. Snail sauce with yam? Exactly. We can have that for lunch, three of us. Hmm. You really are a rare jam. You know that? No, but I believe when you say it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you are. Hmm? No, 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 don't say that. After stalking me with so much food, this is the least I could do. I assist you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for helping out. Come on, it's okay. So, Louis tells me you guys are getting married soon. Mm -hmm. Wow, and then you put him through a lot of stress at the proposal. No, I didn't. But I got to see a Twitter side of him. I mean, as soon as I came through the door, he proposed. And then he had his romantic dinner laid out. It was very sweet. He cooked? Mm-hmm. Louis cooked. <laughs> wow, that's um, what he really does. Oh, he's a very good cook. He wow. is. I was surprised. He is. Well, you have a very strong will of movement. And it's a miracle for him to cook for you. Right? <laughs> well, I hope so because your friend has a stronger hold on me. Oh, look who is blushing. <laughs> we made him gossip. Oh, okay. So when women talk, we are gossiping. But when men talk, it's discussion. 
<laughs> How will I do for you? No, nothing. This is last plate, so you could just eat in the living room. Uh -huh. No, I'd rather watch you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, baby. Just got home. I'm talking to let you know. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. Yeah, she's right here with me. <laughs> okay, hang on. Hey, hi. <clears throat> I'm fine. What's up? Hope you got home safe. Yeah, thanks for today. I had so much fun. Thank you, dear. All right, I'll talk to you tomorrow, yeah? Bye, bye, good night. Hold on. Okay, baby. Good night. Love you too. <laughs> so, Mama Sita, mm. you're breezing and out of town without letting me know, huh? You know, the number of times Abed told me you were in town, I never got to see you. Come on, why do you keep emphasizing on those two times? I explained to you that it was really tight for me. That's why I couldn't see. Oh, you. sorry, you don't cry. Go, Jordi. <laughs> so, how have you been? How's your man? Um, Emmanuel, right? <clears throat> oh, money. <laughs> he's fine. He's cool. You sure? Yes, he's fine. I'm surprised at you. I can't remember telling you about him. Oh, you know, keep things away from me, right? Mm -mm. What else are you hiding? Tell me. Has he proposed to me? <laughs> he asked it too much questions. He hasn't proposed. Rest. He had better yes. done that before someone else whisks you away. Tell him to come put a seal on that deal. <laughs> wow. That girl has done quite a number on you. There's this thing normal people do when they're encroaching other people's spaces. I know it's going to sound very strange to you, but it's called knocking. <laughs> All you do is tap just. You know what? What do you want? Okay, the question. Where, Where have, have you been? been? For three days, sister. And two nights, Flora. Don't forget. Both of you are unbelievable. Ah. Okay, the answer. Turn it. I was with my boo. We, we knew, knew it! it. <laughs> hmm. You've never spent two nights in a row with him, love. Mom's gonna kill you. She's gonna skin you alive. Okay. You see, things have changed. I'm no longer his girlfriend. What? I'm not his fiance. Oh my god! He didn't! What do you mean he did? Of course he did! Oh, <laughs> oh my god! god. Oh, no. <laughs> Rose? Hi, good evening. Where have you been? You don't go to university, so you're wearing at night glasses. Girl, for two nights. I'm Elsie Lewis. Is that supposed to make me jump for joy? Mom, things are different now. No. They're getting married. Yeah, yeah. He proposed. Let me see. Hmm. 
This is not right. But it's okay. <laughs> I'm happy for you. Oh, me, thank you. <laughs> and the rest of you, maintain decorum. All that noise attracted me. You are women. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Yeah! <laughs> 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 All right, guess what? Time for you to get out of my room. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Gojo, shut my door. Shut the door. Hello. Hey there, Alfana. I'm good, and you? I'm all right. So, okay, I know this. When you usually take a break from work, it's culture for you. I know, I know. You know how it is with work for me, okay? <laughs> but I'm, I'm taking a break now, okay, actually, cool. yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. Cool, cool. Uh, Terry, sorry, can I call you back? Oh, okay. I just remembered uh, Rose kept calling incessantly while I was working, and you know how it is. I don't pick calls when I'm working. Oh. Please, 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 you have to call her back immediately. You need to let okay. her understand why you couldn't call her, why you couldn't take her calls, yeah? All right, sure. I'll get back to you. All right, no problem. Talk to you later. Yeah. Bye. All right, yeah. Hey, hey, darling. Honestly, I'm sorry, Okay. Yes, I, I still have missed calls. You know how it is. I was working, so I couldn't take calls. Hope you're not angry. What for? Okay, all right. All right, I'll, I'll talk with her. I'll take care of you, okay? Love you. Hey, Terry, I, yeah, I just spoke with her. No, no. She demands for your number. Uh, I don't, I don't know, actually, I don't think so, but why didn't you give her a call? Okay, you send it to her, okay? No. All right, talk to you later. Bye. He's out to his boss right now. Me too. Right then, let's go straight to the planet. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, is my mom home? Yeah, she just come back. No, no, no. Did you make dinner for her? They did not even chop, Steph. Okay, Flora is around. No, but just today, her room. So 
mal Boston. <laughs> Some of your silly. Uh -uh. Uh -huh. Oh, it's fine, Joe. Thanks for asking. <sighs> What's an I really wish you could be here. I would be happier, Joe. It would make I don't know, make the whole day more interesting. Of course, I'll send you pictures. I'll attach an entire album. <laughs> uh, hold on. Come in. Okay, so I'll call you back, okay? All right, love you, bye. Auntie Rose, right now I'll come with your clothes to do. Okay, what's up, my mom's one? You know, bring all. Oh, now, so I bring. Okay, I'm just come with okay. Can you help me call Flora on your way, please? Tell us to call. Thank you. What's up? Just good. Call to thank you for helping Rose with the plants. This is way too kind of No, come on. I'm glad I was able to help. Mm. Alright. Have a good night, right? <laughs> Let's see tomorrow. We haven't spent any time together. Sure. Alright, no problem. I'll see you tomorrow. Ah, bye. For a walk. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, how long have you known Rose? Uh, give and take two months. Two months? Mm -hmm. You're kidding me. Go! Are you proposed to her already? Come on, two months is too short to propose to a girl you just met. Are you sure about this? Honestly, I don't know, but it's a risk I want to take, Terry. Don't give me that shocking look as though it doesn't happen every day. Have you forgotten it? He do got married to his wife barely a month after the next. Or is it Leonard? Leonard is living happily for two years now with his wife. And they got married barely two weeks they knew each other. Is it not about the time? I think it's about going for what you want. I know, but you don't strike me like that kind of person. Come on, whatever worked for Leonard might not work for you. Different strokes for different folks. Look, you, you guys need time to know each other, understand, study yourselves. How can you propose to a girl within two months? Oh, just know that whatever you have decided to do, I'm going to stand right behind or beside, no, beside you. As though I grew up Because Rose is a very sweet and young girl, but she's really younger than you. And respectful. Oh. That's a part I like. She doesn't take too many things for granted, and I think it's a plus. Wow. Now I understand. So I'm sure you had issues with um, girls of our age group. Because we are too strong-willed. Too for you to take. <laughs> Funny you. Anyway, the truth is, um, we'll get to understand ourselves as we get along. And hey, I'm a full grown man willing to get married, loaded. <laughs> and Rose happens to be available. So, this do you is... love her? Yeah, I can say that. And what love is not enough for understanding, trust, and communication will cover for. Anyways, just know that you are a man right now, yeah? Uh -huh. And I'm going to tell you one thing. Which Just is? one thing. You know you're a stubborn cow. So you need to give her time to adapt to your stubbornness. Now I'll kick you. Like seriously, I'm going to <laughs> Can't you tell when I want to be left alone? Can't you give me a break? Can't you let me be? Do you hear what? 
what he said to me. Tell me, what did I do that was wrong now? Um, look, okay, this is not about you. That's how we act. I'm sure he's trying to sort out something and it's not just clicking for him. So, this has nothing to do with you, okay? So don't bother your head. He has never yelled at me. Louis has never yelled at me before. Terry, I thought he was going to hit Come me. Come on, Louis will never raise a finger at you. Never. I know him so well. He will never do that. I'm sure he's not just in a good mood. And <laughs> you know how it is. What you do right now, yeah? Pretend like nothing happened. It becomes a mood. Just um, act like everything is fine. Everything is normal. You know how it is, yeah? It'll be fine, all right? He's your husband. He's as good as your husband. <laughs> so you need to understand him, understand his moods, and know when it swings so you know how to just follow him gradually. Okay. Alright? Okay. What we we'll do right now? We we'll go to the kitchen and then prepare something for your husband to eat. Yeah? <laughs> Come on, just cheer up. Alright? <laughs> You really love to cook. <laughs> Funny, that's the same thing Louis said the third time I was here. But you know what they say, the way to a man's heart is through his stomach. <laughs> Whoever said that must be aiming a bit higher. If you guess my point, right? <laughs> That's some huge work you will have on your hands. And mind you, Diana is an empire, not just some small establishment. Exactly. And I have this assistant who just seems like she's not there. That's why I need your assistance, please. Hey, Terry, I have a lot on my table as well, so don't go. That's why I need your assistance with me. Come on, this is like paying for one of the numerous favors I've done for you. Have you put a gun to your head to do me those favors? So don't make it sound like you had no choice. You can be unnecessarily mean, you know that, right? <laughs> okay. Assuming I agree to help, what's my percentage? Don't give me that. Look, this is business. And in business, time is money. In business, you treat family like strangers and strangers like family. 30% for consulting. We're good, right? We're good. And that's because you're family, mind? Oh, please. Yeah, that reminds me. How is our future wifey? And I hope you've not driven her with your stubborn, stubborn head. She's okay. She's fine. She's at her mother's. She comes around often, you know. Once a while, she pops in. Passes the night. But never two nights in a row. But, like, every day she's around. No, no, no. <laughs> Don't tell me you guys have not spent, like, a week as a stretch together. Mm -mm. You have not? How did you get to know yourselves? This is someone you're supposed to be spending the whole of your life with. Like living together forever till death do you part. So how do you cope? We learn every day. Just like I've learned you can be so caring and considerate of someone you barely know. Okay, I know I have my excesses. But I believe with time she'll try to accommodate it. I mean, we'll, we, we grow. Staying together will make us... Um, Blend, bond, and get to know ourselves better. You know, you're about the only woman I can boast of who knows my in and out, who can tolerate my excesses. But with Rose in the picture, it's another story. But I know with time we'll get along. I miss being open with any woman. With you, I'm very comfortable. Now you're going to make my head bust. Actually, your head is causing an eclipse. <laughs> Boy, wait. 
Look at this man. Hey, man. Oh, what's up? I'm okay. How are you? We're good. We're good. Oh, what do we have here? Hello. Hello. Good and beautiful. How are you? Hmm. We haven't met before, have we? Ah, uh, no, no, no. I don't think so. I don't think so. But you know, I actually wished we've met before. I mean, before now. <laughs> before him. Okay. That's some salutation that could last for a year. Terry, Alfred, Alfred, Terry, my best friend. Your best friend? Mm -hmm. Okay, right now, I'm hot. Sorry, that's the truth. <laughs> Anyways, it's nice to meet you. Oh, pleasure is mine. Okay, um, you know you're a pretty strong woman. How do you cope with this guy? Okay, I'm actually trying to accept that statement. We are doing just fine. Terry, you're trying to. Hey, what's that? And I'm trying to believe you. Hmm. I like the plan so far. Yeah, I've been getting a lot of help. Hmm. Just release without time for you. Uh, it's... Sorry, it was Luis's friend that has been helping me. Oh, I see. Wow. He must be in touch with his feminine side then. He knows a lot about women. Oh, that's because he is a she. What do you mean? I mean, Luis's friend, his best friend actually, she's a female. Oh. Oh. Okay. Your eyes are boring holes through me. Spill. Best friend? I knew it. I knew it. You knew so? Best friend? It's way too uncomfortable. For you? Because I'm fine with it. Okay? So stop being so myopic. You are educated for a reason. Aha. Now they are complete. I swear I knew you were going to tell her. I knew. Come on, Rose. I'm just being concerned. When was the last time you spoke to him? Two days ago. But before you go on, it's only because... And this lady has been with him. <laughs> You're making her sound so old. They're only together because they're working on a project. That's all. What? What? I mean, no, no, she should have told. Oh. There was no way she would have told him. <laughs> That's what, no, it's. Oh, my baby. Look at you. How are you? You haven't called me in two days. Terry, hi. Hey, dear, what's up? I'm sorry, my bad, honestly. I, I have been busy, you know, working like a dog and all that. I haven't had time. 
this is actually the first time. I'm relaxing to see a TV. Please, I know I should have called. Hmm? It's all right. I was just worried. Let me prepare something for us to eat. Uh, um, no, uh, no, we, we, we actually had something. Okay. How was the day? Maybe it was fine. No. Oh. What? No, you're not gonna. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. We have to rewind this. You think you'll see this alone? <laughs> God, it's good. You just to me. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're not telling me this. They kissed? They did! <laughs> <laughs> Why are you smiling? You're really beautiful. <laughs> well, I think you're beautiful too. <laughs> <laughs> Is there something that's been bothering me? Really? What's that? Ever since Terry came, you and I have hardly spent any time together. You're always with her. Yes, I know you're working, but you're always with her and it worries me. Sweetheart. Terry is my best friend, okay? There is nothing intimate between us. Nothing intimate has ever happened between us in our years of friendship. I mean, it can't. Not when we're busy arguing or we just can't stand each other. But we're cool. We're cool that way. Plus, I think you and I are sharing that. <laughs> She's helping out with the wedding preparations, right? Yeah, she is. You see, I told you she's harmless. You can rely on her. I mean, I do. I trust her with my life. I love her. Not the way I love you. <laughs> oh, I feel so much better now that I've spoken to you about this. Sweetheart, you can always talk to me about anything. Okay. You know that, right? Mm. You know that? I know. <laughs> I, you know, know that. I know, I <laughs> know. I know. <laughs> I do remember to ask what happened to you the last time that you had to lash out on Rose. Oh, thank God you came up with this thing. I honestly don't know how to bring it up. What happened that it was my boss told me I was relocating to Ghana? Better pay, more benefits. But he said it was going to be concluded in two months, which was last week. And up till now, I don't know how to break the news to Rose. Wow, wow, wow. <sighs> well, there's actually nothing too difficult to handle. I think what you do is just to bring the wedding closer. Yeah? Get it done before you travel. I don't know if that's if you're ready financially, I mean. If you're ready, fine. You just bring your wedding clothes and prepare for the worst. I still don't know how to go about this. Especially having lashed at her because of it. Don't worry, Louis. She'll be fine. And you'll be fine too. Why don't you just tell her about it today? Uh, okay, I will. Cool. Let her know about it. Um, yes, um, excuse me, sir. There was actually. I can't remember sending for you. I know you badging on me next time. I'm sorry. Better. Let this be the last time. So, what is it? Um, the minutes from the last meeting with Steve. Thank you. If that will be all. Nice ass. 
I don't see that. She's trying really hard. Really hard. She's good and efficient, so I see past all of that. Really? Yeah. Um, it shouldn't cause us to worry for days. I mean, we we can shift the wedding closer. <laughs> exactly. Okay, I'm fine with that. Thanks for making this easier, Rose. Honestly, I... Terry actually told me you would understand. You know, she would be of help wherever and whenever you need her for the wedding preparations. Terry knew about this before I did. Louise, this is what I'm talking about. Things you should tell me first, you tell Terry. Yes, Louise, I'm the one you should be talking to now. Oh, hey, I, I should be your confidant. Louise, it's me that's your fiance. It's not like that. Mm. Don't make it sound like I went out of my way to tell her. No, she asked me the reason I lashed at you the other day. Which I'm still very sorry about till this day. I didn't have a choice but to tell her. I'm sorry, baby, okay? I'm sorry on both counts. Please. Please. Fine. Thank you. I'm going to file your nails now, so get them long. Uh, so that it's you. <laughs> So nice. <laughs> Thank you. Is that ginger? Mm -hmm. And garlic. Are you going to put that in the stew? Oh, of course. No, no, no. Don't use it. Louis doesn't like it at all. Trust me, he is a very good cook. And he would definitely notice the taste of that in it. I always use ginger and garlic in my stew. It gives it a fantastic taste and aroma, and I know for a fact that you will love it. I, I know. I, I know, but whenever you're cooking for him, I'd advise you don't uh, use it because he wouldn't eat it. If you want him to eat, make sure you don't put any of that in it. Okay. I, I really like it. I don't
Because we were arranging the room. <laughs> the living room, the entire thing. Why? Did you ask him? No, but it's going to be so no, 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 you shouldn't do that. You don't like it. He loves his comfort zone so much. He doesn't really like you coming up with this whole surprise thing. Today. No, it's okay. Anytime. How are you? I'm I'm fine, but um okay, so I was thinking, right? Maybe I should start going over to Louis's house more often in the mornings before he leaves for work so I can be preparing his breakfast. I don't know but I get worried about him eating out. Or better yet, what do you think about this? Maybe I can prepare his breakfast before I leave his house in the evenings and then in the morning he'll just microwave it. What do you think? Um, that's, um, actually sweet and thoughtful of you. <sighs> but, but, you should know that Louis doesn't take breakfast in the morning before he goes to work. Kind of disturbs his stomach later in the day. Yeah? <laughs> he prefers to start his meal anytime from 12. Really? Mm. I didn't even know that. Oh, my I'm poor sorry. baby. <laughs> Uh -huh. oh, okay. oh my gosh, I'm yawning, sorry. Okay, um, <laughs> I need to get to bed, so we'll probably talk tomorrow. Alright then. Alright, thanks for the day. advice again. No, it's okay, anytime. Right, Good night. Good night, Ooh. bye. Babe, so I was thinking, maybe Terry and I can go swimming this weekend while you're at your meeting. <laughs> Sweetheart, Terry does not swim. As a matter of fact, she has a great fear for any body of water bigger than the size of a bathtub. Louise, I don't swim either. But maybe we could just lounge around the pool, feel cute in our bathing suits, just have fun. She wouldn't buy that idea. R Rose, that? R R Rose, hey! Rose. I'm tired. Louise, I'm just tired. Terry knows you way better than I do. And the way both of you go on, it's, it makes me feel so insecure. Why are we discussing this? I thought we'd been through this before. I told you, Terry and I. I know. Okay, I know, I get it. You guys are childhood best friends, I guess it's and it's fine. But the fact is that uh, I now realize that you and I barely know each other, Louis. Since Terry came, look, this whole wedding, marriage, it's filling me with so many questions. Questions like 
What if? What if we don't even get along as a couple? What if we get married and, and we don't fit and we find out that we maybe that we can't even stand each other? Oh, wait, what, what if we're even rushing all this? What? Louis, see, I was so excited eh, about spending the rest of my life with you. But since Terry came, I have been I've been filled with so many doubts. That's because she and I have known ourselves longer. Mm. I keep telling you there is nothing to it. We're just friends. Why do you doubt me? Please, you don't have to worry yourself about this, okay? Can we not talk about this again? Move in with me. Yeah. We're engaged to get married, right? In two weeks. We're as good as man and wife. Why don't you just move in with me and I'll stay here. Louise, I love you so much. So much. <sighs> That's a yes. It's a no. What's well, two weeks, right? And besides, I know you like your space. So why don't you use those two weeks getting used to the fact that I will be a permanent housemate for the rest of your life, for the rest of our lives? your office already? No, I came as soon as I got your call. Hmm. You want something? Tea? Amaka? No, 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 no. I'm okay. I'm fine. Thank you. Alright, so, let's get to it then. I understand that... Sorry, madam. You called me. Oh, never mind. You may leave. Good morning, sir. Good morning. As I was saying... We are enlightened. And there's nothing wrong with having friends. But my daughters, three of them mean the world to me. And I do hate to see them hurt. Your best friend seems to me a little too close for comfort. I do like to know that I shouldn't consider her a threat to my daughter and her happiness with you. She's in safe hands. Hmm. Just making sure. Hey, you, how are you? I'm fine. Hi. Same old. You forgot I existed this weekend, right? Mm, not sure. How is Rose? Is she fine? Uh, no, 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 not at all. Just that we got into a little argument and she got into a mood. But we're good. We're good. We've discussed it. But you know how it is now. She's still a little upset. You want me to talk with her? Oh, no, 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 no. I can handle that. I can. 
Okay, um, there's something I came across over the weekend and I want us to go through it together. Okay, cool. You drive safely. Alright, then. <laughs> Is that Rose? Yeah. You should take the call. It might be urgent. <laughs> Hello? You know I can do this now. I'm at work. Oh, God. I'll deal with that when I get home. The designer won't be able to provide the bow tie and the cufflinks before the wedding date. That's what you call urgent. She just doesn't get it. Um, well, back to business. Yeah, I was going to tell you. Please check the, the total for the um, equipment. What's, what's yours? What's the cost there? Because mine is saying 50%. I don't know if it's correct. No, I have 47 here. Are you sure? It's yeah. to, because the marginal... Okay. I'll see her when I get home. Aha, uh -huh. that reminds me. Terry, I think you should come home with me at least. Eat, get some rest before you go back to the hotel. <sighs> Whatever you say, Captain. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. Ever lived with money? No. But we've spent um, good times together in each other's company. But not been with him for more than a week though. <laughs> but this is not about us. It's about you. So why are you asking? He's the right one, yeah? Yup. <laughs> okay, get going. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Meet me in the car. Take this off. Take those off! Define that reception. Louisa, beg, I'm not in your mood. Please. Does that answer my question? Rosalind, what kind of reception was that? Huh? And sit up when I'm talking to you. Oh, Louis, 
see, I called you earlier today. The way you just hung the phone up on me. As Are you crazy? Are you mad? Is something wrong with you? You can handle a simple crisis at home? I go and have a long day at work every day, hoping to come back to peace and sanity, and I get greeted with that attitude? You disrespect me? Are you mad? I have a mind of ending you now. Louis, stop talking to me as if I'm a child. Why are you shouting? If you have something to say to me, then say it quietly. Why are you shouting? Do you think you're the only one that can shout? You think you're the only one that can shout? Hey, Louis, what the fuck is that about? You used the F word on me? Rosalie. You said fuck to me. Hell yes. I said fuck to you. <laughs> uh -huh. What will you do? What will you do about it? Louis, it's me and you in this relationship. Do you know what that means? It means I have a say. I have a say. But you this man, eh? You've been taking me for granted, though. The way you've been taking me for granted, Louis. I will continue using the fuck word if it gets your freaking attention. You get out of my life. You don't mean that, do you? I'm serious. In fact, I'm so serious, yeah? That I will wake up tomorrow morning and I will not regret saying this. Because, Louise, I am... I am fed up. So I hope you're happy you won. I'm done with you completely. Please leave me alone. Please leave me alone. Why you hold me? You don't take me alone. Oh, you just freak me. Stop. Please stop now. You don't take me for granted. What am I doing here? Why you never want me? Why you want to marry me? Why you want to give me your name? Why? Sir. How's it going? I I'm very fine, sir. I will be at your end by tomorrow. Oh, okay. I is something wrong? Just a minute. Oh. Okay. All right, sir. Uh, I'll make sure everything is in place before you arrive. All right. You have a good night. O okay, sir. Good night. Hi. 
Hör so. Ja, so du es gut. Ima. Ihr Crush. Okay, no, I'm too old for crushes. This one, I will agree. Anyways, he said he'll be in town tomorrow. What? Oh, Terry, I've not covered enough to make a presentation. What are we going to do? I knew you wouldn't be ready, so I had to sort it out. My friend actually helped me. <laughs> oh, but would have it deducted from both our checks. Okay, that's fine by me. As long as it will save my neck this time. Hey, hey, don't even go there. I've helped you more than just once, so don't Thank go you, there at all. You. You're welcome, dear. So, I'll see you tomorrow. Most definitely. You have to be in the office early, so we'd have this sorted out before you arrives. Thank you. <laughs> Good night. Good night, thank you. <sighs> Reggie, you should have done this on your own now. Instead of making me go through it over and over again. Terry, I'm sorry. I, I didn't... Oh my God. He's here. Who? Oh? Hello, ladies. Good day, sir. <clears throat> Terry, are you alright? Good, good day, sir. I asked if you were okay. I'm fine. Good. <clears throat> well, so what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Not sure. So yeah, yeah, here's the file for Agro Limited. Sarah, you know you're a very smart woman. Um, that's so sweet. Thank you. So tell me how the boss makes you feel so nervous and out of breath. I don't know. You don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Terry. You have to tell him already. I mean, you've been on his case for for a year. And then what? Get that pity pity look, or a compensating dinner, or even a more uncomfortable working environment. Come on now. I know you'd most likely play the worst scenario in your head. But Terry, have you tried playing the best scenario? Look, I did, but it just wouldn't work. I tried. I did what I could help. me much <laughs> you bet <laughs> well been with Manny just get off my phone <laughs> get off my phone <laughs> get out <laughs> Maybe I, yeah, 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 yeah. You'll be miracles to see. I the feel you die, 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 die. And I be your miracle, Baba.
days. Are you okay? You want me to get you a drink? I'm tensed. Terry, I'm tensed. I need you to talk to me. Look at me. Take a deep breath. Breathe in. Hmm? Breathe in. Out. You feel better, right? <laughs> I am your best friend, and I know what is good and right for you. You've made the best choice by choosing Rose as your wife. She's the most beautiful, endearing, loving woman I have ever met. <laughs> <laughs> She's going to be a good wife. So just relax your mind, okay? <laughs> I should get you a drink. Uh, no, um, uh, don't worry. It's just, that reminds me. How's Rose's surprise coming up? That. God, she'll be so amazed and blown out when she finds out. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I just I just want to make her happy on her big day. Oh, that's so sweet. So have you heard from your folks yet? <laughs> They're here. <laughs> oh, cool then. Alright, um, you know what? I'll just um take care of them. You just relax. You know what we're talking about. <laughs> I love you, man. Love you too. What can I do without <laughs> you? Congratulations. Thank you. Now we're on the land. All right, I need to just go. Okay. <laughs> okay. I had a fantastic flight. Wow. As a matter of fact, we had a cozy and smooth flight. Very good then. <laughs> Where's my son? Uh, he's upstairs preparing for the day. Beautiful. <laughs> Let me go clamp him in the back and chat with him a little bit. Okay. All right? Welcome, hey, sir. Hey, Gerard, take care of the bag, right? <laughs> hey. Hey, Hello, how are you? So good. Very well. Thank you, Dad. I'm glad he could make it. Son, I wouldn't miss your wedding for anything in oh, this world. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, how was your flight? Flight was good. But you know, 10, 15 hours in a flight for an old man like me, it ain't no joke. <laughs> and how's Gerald? Uh, he's outside with Terry. Okay. Not that it matters right now, but I've always thought that both of you will end up together. Where have you been? Oh, no. Well, how's everything going on? Perfect. Are you sure? 
Please. Terry, you've not dressed. I'm not going to be your chief bridesmaid. And it's now you're not. You see, I said something was going to go wrong. You see, I have a little surprise for you, though. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. She should have told me soon. Tana! You were leaving the room, right? Uh, oh my god, how? How did you get here? When? How? She did everything. She brought me over. No, I did not. Louis did everything. Paid for our airfare and everything. He said it's going to be a good idea. She came. Wow. So we worked it out. <laughs> what? I really love that man. <laughs> that, that's so silly of me, Every time I think of the things you do, you me see For better for us, I go be with you so big She see I from Kenya. so sure you were going to end up marrying one white man there. <laughs> Hell no. Can I, I, I love to flirt with them, not settle down. Mm -hmm. I mean, Tana can seem to find a man I love mm -hmm. as much as I love me, myself, and <laughs> I. <laughs> but I kind of love my Nigerian dudes, though. <laughs> of course you do. <laughs> By the way, I ran into Marlene the other day at the mall. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. And... Come girl, we should be hanging out together sometimes. What's up with you and Wait, 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 how is she? She, she? She's good. I mean, come on, she's supposed to be good. And I heard the, the father is listening to now. I know. I see him on TV every now and then. Oh, yeah? Maybe we really should be hanging out with her. <laughs> um, this, uh, what's her name? Teresa, Teresa, Ter Terry. That's with her. Oh, no, come on, she's really nice. I mean, is she your hubby's um, sibling? Oh, no, 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 no. Terry and Louise are best friends. They've been friends since they were children. That's over 20 years now. And Tana, you're going to love her. She is so nice. Hey, seriously, you'll see. You're going to love her. Seriously? <laughs> what? What? I'm nothing. Tana, what? You're too naive for my liking, Rose. Open your eyes. I mean, these people are just too close. Jeez. Okay, I tried to understand it from the angle that they are siblings. And now you're telling me that they are BFF? For real? 
I don't need to take that. Hell no. Hell, hell no. Ah, uh, calm down. Okay. <laughs> calm down. Louise and Terry are just friends. And honestly, I'm cool with it. She's my friend too. Ready? Okay. All right, sister. You know, I've been there, done that, and girl, you know, I've traveled, right? Okay, something happened back in the States, yeah? I mean, there's this couple, sweet couple. He had uh, the husband, had this best friend, if you know best friend, and of course the wife was cool with it. Now, they moved in together with an understanding. Yeah, everything was cool. But guess what, darling? What? Hobby was shagging his own best friend. It didn't end here, darling. She, she got pregnant for him. Yeah, and the case landed in court. Yeah. I mean, how can you tell me that a man as sweet as Lewis has been with this BFF, whatever, Teresa, Teresa, or whatever her name is, for 20 years, and nothing has happened? <laughs> I find that hard to believe. Uh, Tanasi, yeah, I've, I've actually talked to Lewis about this expressively. And he assured me that I have nothing to worry about. And guess what? I believe him. I, I know the kind of man I'm married to. And I, I, I believe him. Why did you talk about it? If it wasn't unnatural. Yes. You were lying to yourself, girl. Yeah. You know my honest opinion? If I were you, I would make the bitch go. Yes, make the bitch go. She has to go. So you can have some peace of mind in your marriage. Think about it. If you were the one who has this very fine, sexy male friend as your BFF, how do you think Lucy take it? Now just be very, very true to yourself. Come on, darling. I mean, I'm not fighting you. I just, I'm just looking out for you, I baby. Know, you I know, know it. I know, I know, I know. You know. What? Don't give me that look. Cheers. 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 Tana. I know the man I married, okay? I trust him and... I have nothing to be worried about. There you go again. So once the presentation is done, we'll get to know what to take. Louis! Hey! <laughs> Terry! Hi! Hello! Mm. Mm, look at you! What are you guys doing? Hi, Terry. We actually came to see a friend of ours who has I'm somebody. Sorry. Emmanuel. Louis. Louis. Reggie, Reggie. Louis. Aha! Alpha. Finally, a face to the name. Louis? My pleasure. You know, Terry's told me a lot about you and. Yes. A very private person. Just say hi and bye. Okay. Hi and bye. See ya. Bye bye, Terry. Bye. Bye. Quite a funny friend you have there. Well, where were we? Yeah, sorry. The presentation. So, I said I'm not sure if it's so for me. How's Terry? She's fine. Were you with her today? No, but 
we'll definitely see tomorrow. We haven't yet completed our job together. Would you tell me if there's anything going on between both of you? <coughs> what do you mean by that? Would you tell me if you were having sex with your best friend? I won't do this with you. I refuse to do this. Louis, if you walk out, then it means you're guilty. And I will have you know that I refuse to be a special kind of fool for you. What the hell is wrong with you? Why are you like this? How many times have we gone over this? Did you see anything implicating? How can I possibly see anything implicating when you're so good at covering your tracks? I had a rough day and this is so not how I want to end it. Louis, if you walk out of this house, I will leave. And I will leave your ugly wedding ring on your matrimonial bed. Louis! Hey, what's up? What? At my door? At this time of the night? Oh, okay. No. Hey, what's up? Are you okay? It's just all right. Is Rose all right? Rose is fine, Terry. Talk to me. I'm tired. Honestly. I had a rough day at work today, hoping to go home and cool off, but it seems the devil has gotten into Rose. She, she's made me so miserable. I'm tired. Um. You want to talk about it? I want to sleep. Terry. Can I pass the night here? I can't go back there. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, you can. Are you sure you don't want to tell me what is bothering you? No, thanks. Tomorrow. checking your home safe. I am. Look, what you share with Rose is very special. That's why I didn't let you sleep over. Um, about last night. Look, it's never happened. We can live with that, can't we? Besides, it was just a kiss. 
Yeah. Uh, all right, then. I'll talk to you tomorrow, yeah? All right. Right. Bye. Right. Sorry about last night, okay? It's okay. I'm Hey, what's up? Yeah, need to go over a new idea that came to my mind. Oh, really? It concerns your work. Stop by my office. Oh, uh, all right. Uh, I'll, I'll see you in a bit. All right. Bye. Hey, man. Badass, man. What's <laughs> up? Pretty good. I'm good. How are you? Mm. Man, I'm um, hungry. Can, can we go have something? Let's go out for lunch. I... I'm good. I'm okay. I'm fine. Okay. I will just... Um, hang on. Hello? Adi, please get me a glass of water. Thank you. Hey, bro, listen. We've been friends for long, okay? Tell me what's eating you up. You can share with me, you know. I'm fine. I'm good. I'm okay. Yeah, I'm good. Sure. I'm fine. Okay. Um. Sir, um, you want to? Okay. I'll be off for now, Adi. You're sure there is nothing more you want me to do for you? If I need you, I'll let you know. Um, Adi, that will be all. Thank you. Go. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Thank you. Damn. She's too efficient and reliable. I Maybe mean, she would have been out of here long ago. Pay her no attention. Oh, wait. Pay that ass no attention? Hey! Did, did, did you see the ass? Oh, my God. <laughs> Man, that's what I call Mamma Mia. Yeah. <laughs> hey! Don't go there. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, back to what I was saying. For real. What's wrong with you? Um, I'm okay. I'm fine. Don't worry.
He asked me to come. <sighs> Lewis. Look, I had to abandon every other thing I was doing because you sounded urgent. God, Terry, you are beautiful. Lewis, can we just get to work? <sighs> We're not doing this, right? You said it's work. Let's get to it. Let's get out of here. You don't command me around. Terry. So, here we are. We can't keep pretending like nothing happened. staring at me like that, you know what I'm talking about. I'm sorry, I don't. Um, I'll just uh, set up the laptop so we can... Terry, I wasn't drunk that night, neither were you. We both did what, what we did clear-headed. Fine, we, we may have been wrong, but... I'm not sorry about it. You heard me. I'm not sorry. I feel for you something I've never felt in all the years we've known ourselves. Yeah, call me crazy. It's okay, but... I never felt this intimacy with you. It was a bittersweet experience, and I love it. I, I never knew I could find in you something I needed in a woman, but... Now that you're here, please, please stay. This is so unfair. I, I know, and I'm sorry. Lewis, you are married. <laughs> you have Emmanuel too. About that, there's something you need to know. Emmanuel is just my boss. I'm not seeing anyone. You know, my life is just so complicated. Shh, 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 shh. It's okay. Don't, 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 don't cry. It's okay. Don't, don't cry. So, Tana. Yeah. Any guy caught your fancy yet? Nah, not yet. Well, maybe if you reduce your standard to something a little more realistic, it would happen. <laughs> <laughs> why can't I have everything I want? I mean, why must I settle? There is nothing wrong with getting what you want. You know, because Tana always, always gets everything she wants. Yeah, yeah. Except what Tana wants is always very expensive. Mm -hmm. Speaking of which, Tana, why are you spending so much money staying at a hotel when you can stay here with me? Hell no. No, 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 no. Don't even go there. No. It would save you a lot of money. Come on, just while you're around. I love my space, darling. Okay. Okay, fine. Okay. Ooh. You changed your mind though. Is, is the planting ready? She hasn't oh, even uh, finished cutting it. Are you serious? Sit down, sit down, sit down. Sit down, sit down. What the hell? Chef manager. Take everything. Do everything. So, how's Terry? She's good. Maybe we should invite her for lunch this weekend. You know, we'll just hang. And then we can invite Tana too. That way it'll be a complete crowd. What do you think? Okay, uh, that'll be fine. You know what? Maybe I should call her myself. Actually, I should invite her myself. My phone is downstairs, I'm coming. Let me go and call her. Alright. No, no, 
no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, Look, 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 I, I, I can't do this. Honestly, I can't. I don't like it. I'm, I'm, I'm not too hungry to stick my head with you guys. Oh. No, no, Terry, no. I want to see you hungry. Uh, so, uh, the babies will sound so funny and make me laugh out loud, but I need to see you. And the only way to see you is if you come around for lunch this weekend. Louis, Louis, just stop. Don't do this. I really hate it when you do this. I don't. I don't like it. Don't do this. Just stop it. It's... it's um, sorry, please hold on. Oh. Um, uh, um, just, just hold. Um, Rose is on the line. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Um. Hi, Terry. It's been a while I heard from you. How's work been? Uh. <sighs> Actually, I think you need a break this weekend, so I'd love for you to come oh. with us and my friend tomorrow. I'm making very good snail sauce too. Please! It's been really long since you came around. Oh, 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 really? <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. That's um, very thoughtful of you. Oh, Alright then, I I I'll see you tomorrow, right? Oh, oh look. <laughs> I'm feeling sleepy. I have to go to bed. Yeah. I'll, I'll see you tomorrow, right? Good night. Um, hi. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Just get out of my phone. Hello, busy woman. Hey, how are you? <laughs> I'm not too early. You know how I get these food gardens for your food? I didn't want to miss none. What are you doing? Let me help. Okay. Uh -uh, okay. All right. Hey, hey, babe. Hi. Hey, that was great. <laughs> Please hurry up with that, okay? I'm famished. I'll just go take a shower and then come downstairs. I have the reputation of being the only man on the table today. <laughs> All right, you go do that. You go. sure? You sure you want me to go? Come on, babe. <laughs> we have Tana in the house. We have a guest. Come on, babe. It's so funny. Oh, he has his moments, I guess. Tell me all. <laughs> Hello, Terry. D don't tell me you have changed your mind. Hello, I'm here. Hello? Hello, are you there? Louis, I am in front of your gate. Stop sounding like a child. <laughs> all right. <laughs> so he's still the half chef manager. Of course, that's never going to change. After the first time I cooked for Louis, eh? oh, yeah. I was like a woman on a mission. Oh, <laughs> I know. Get way on and on about how he loves my cooking. I know you, girl. <laughs> Can you me get the door? I think that should be Terry. You mean your husband? Tana, be nice, please. I invited her. I'm just trying. I mean, I'm just trying. Go and open the door. Good girl, switch on. <laughs> <laughs>
Be nice, okay, please? Thank you. What is almost ready? You want something to drink? Uh, no, I'd rather join you guys in the kitchen. Oh, no, just relax, okay? Have a seat. We're almost done. You came. What's up, though? How far? I'm good. I'm okay. How is madam? Hmm, she's fine. Food is ready, guys. Oh, um, we should probably get to that. Food is ready. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Done with the fruit salad. Just wait a little and have some, please. Are you serious? You want to kill me? <laughs> you got me fed so much. You know, I like that snail sauce, so you made it really nice and made me feed and feed and feed <laughs> myself. I'm very well, darling. Thank you very much. I had a great time. I'm glad. Hopefully, that means you'll come again soon. Yeah. Definitely. She doesn't have a choice. I will come back and have <laughs> that sauce. <laughs> no problem. All right, see you in a jiffy, baby. <laughs> Hmm. You made my day. <laughs> Could barely have engaged in that conversation the way you did. <laughs> you see why I need you around me. Oh, please. Oh, Louis, don't say that. You're going to make me do something stupid like believe you. I love you. I mean it. Believe me. Oh, come on, don't do that. <laughs> Uh, okay, I. I'll see you on Monday. All right, I'll talk to you. All right, drive safe. Hey, what took you so long? Where's Louis? 
Luis is, is coming. He's coming. Yeah. Mm. Are you okay? Yeah. Oh, baby. Mm. You saw her off? Yeah, I did. Okay. There we go. Mm. I like how you make everything taste special when I do it. Mm. For fruit salad. Because mm. you always do it the right way. Hey, Rose, remember that offer to come stay at your place? Can I call up the offer again? Because I've thought about it and I realized I'm spending so much, but I'm not supposed to. I mean, it's so unnecessary. Oh, I'm on my way to go get me some fragrance. I'm out, almost out. Sure, I will. You're my girl. I will. See you in no time, baby. What do you think about Tana staying here until she goes back to the States? I, I mean, she came to Nigeria for me anyway, so why is she spending so much staying in a hotel, right? <sighs> Rose, I would have loved to help her, but I barely know her. What if she comes here and exerts negative influence on you and I regret allowing her knowing I could have averted it? I just want you to understand that. I understand, but... Louise, never judge a book by its cover. Tana is completely harmless, and you will agree by the time you get to know her better. Please, just till she leaves two weeks. All this waiting around for NYSC posting. I would really appreciate the company if she was here. <laughs> two weeks and she's off, right? Two weeks. No Two extensions. weeks. Okay, okay. No. <laughs> yeah. All right. Have it. You don't want some more? No, no, okay. I'm good. I'm good. All right, baby. Thank you, baby. You know me. Let's go. Come on. Small, small, small. Well, when you 
gets it, I will show you everything. Oh yeah? Yes. Oh my god. I'll show you your room. I, I designed cannot. it in a way that you will like it. You will be your rare taste. Ta-da! Uh-huh. <laughs> okay, so this is where you'll be staying. Hopefully you find it comfortable. Yeah, way comfortable, darling. I like. Good. Thank you. Good. Oops. Uh, <laughs> hold up. I hope the master's bedroom is not so close because I need a lot of quiet at night. <laughs> Tell mm -hmm. me. The master's bedroom is two doors down, but you'll be fine, I guess. <laughs> You guess. <laughs> I have to make the right. You have to. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You love breasts can go ahead and get your freak on. I'll pretend I didn't hear a thing. Morning after. You will never change. What? Okay. Let me get your bar. <laughs> hey, you love my space. Thanks. Ah, yeah. Hi. <laughs> ah, baby. Sultan has got outside. Yeah, she's already in and settled. Okay, okay, okay. How was work? Work was fine, just stress and all that. Just need to go upstairs, get a shower, and take a nap. Okay, after that, dinner. Sure. For sure. Bye. Hey. Hey, sorry, sorry, sorry I woke you. It's alright. What are you doing? <sighs> Trying to fix myself some late night light. Alright. Um We haven't really had time to get to know each other. It's okay. Don't hurt Rose. I won't. I mean it. So whatever you do, I want you to know that the walls have ears and the roof has eyes. I was selling you, I checked Rose, online. Please, I'm tired. Let me rest. No, but just look now at your pictures. Rose, okay. can I sleep? Hey man, how's it going? <laughs> I trust you to keep them entertained. A boss is never late. <laughs> Hi Louis, good morning. Hello, good morning, how are you? Great, after work? Yeah. Have a great day then. All right, and you too. Almost ready, then we'll go off. Okay, nice. Then. Did you need something? Where is Louis going? Louis is going for a meeting. Official, right? 
obviously. It didn't sound like it. Sorry, I don't get. He didn't sound like he was going for an official meeting. Besides, he definitely didn't dress official. Okay, so in conclusion... Today's Saturday, Rose. Sarah, you need to calm down, though. honestly. You need to calm down. You don't trust anybody at all. Can't you smell it? Rose, can't you see it? Okay, where do you think Terry will be by now? Terry will be in her hotel. So please, calm down, turn off. Oh, Rose. You are such a sweet innocent. Tana, I need... Girl, listen. It's too hot that this guy cheats on you. But it's too hot more that he cheats on you with someone you trust. Come on! Hey, Louis, welcome. Thank you. Where's my wife? She's upstairs. Okay. <sighs> hey, babe. Hey. You had a good day? Are you okay? Where were you? I went for a meeting with Alfred and some prospective clients. Told you about it. Was Terry there? No, she wasn't. No female was there. Trust me. I went to Terry's hotel. She wasn't there. And? Maybe she was with you. I'll just ask her. Just stop. Louis, please. Don't do this, please. Don't shut me out. Rose, I need you to stop. Louis, tell me what's happening now. Tell you what? What the hell do you want me to tell you? For Christ's sake, why are you so insecure? I am here with you, am I not? I am right here with you. It's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. What else do you want me to give you? I have given you my name. What else do you want from me? I don't know. 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 <sighs> I can't do this. I can't. I can't do this. I had a long day at work. All I need now is to get a good shower, take some rest. I need peace. So, I don't give you peace and she does? Oh. Is that what you're saying? Jesus Christ. I... Where are you going, Louis? Louis! Just stumped out. Is everything okay? I don't know. Oh. I don't know. <sighs> no. no. I don't know. No, no, no. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I got you.
Hi, hello. She knows. Uh, who knows? What are you talking about? Rose, she knows. Okay, you're still not making any sense. I think she saw me that day I kissed you. Oh my god. Okay, look, I'm going to tell her that I said you should... Oh, no, no. I'll tell her that I forced you to kiss me. No, no, baby, no. I wouldn't let you take the hit for what both of us are involved in. I'll just have to tell her myself. All this mess and all this while for me to realize what I have in you. I feel like I'm in the middle of an ocean, yet I'm drowning. I wish there was a way I could just have you all to myself without anyone being hurt. Terry, now that I have you, I am not letting you go. I'm coming over. No, it's no, no, no. No, don't. Terry, I'm coming over. Louis. Tana. Yes, baby. Louis loves me. Yeah, he loves you. A man can love a hundred women at the same time. I mean, no biggie. I don't want to believe that. Louis is playing a hit game on you. No, he's not. Yes, he is. No, he is not. And I would appreciate it if he stayed out of my marriage and my business. Rose. I... I... <sighs> Listen, I am not supposed to, I mean... Louis, I, I, I saw him kiss Terry. Hmm? That's the name. I know he's, he, he's, he's your first love and, and everything, but... I keep warning you, do not trust people. Don't trust anyone. I mean, these are the things I've, I've been trying to save you from. <laughs> this, this is how pain feels. Heartbreak feels. Tana, you saw what? I, I can, I mean, please leave. I need to think. I need to think. Go. Le go, Listen, Tana. Listen, babe. I can't. Go. 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 Please now. Go.
We used to be best of friends, Terry. I know. I don't know, but if I lost you, I would always cry. Louis. I love you with all of me. Rose? I have to tell her. I will tell her tonight. What are you doing? Making dinner. Um, Rose, you know, I was just trying to tell you the harsh reality of... Tana. I want you out of my house by morning. I just realized that I made a terrible mistake listening to you. Tana, you don't have a man because you can't keep a man. For reasons like your insecurity. Luis and I were doing just fine. You have never trusted anyone you dated. Tana, there are good men out there. A rogue will be a gentleman for the woman he loves. A thief will be a knight for the woman he loves. And if a man is at his worst when he's with you, then he's not yours. Tana, I found my man. And we were doing perfectly together till I almost messed it up. I want you out of my house by first light. And I will do what's right for my family. And that starts with making dinner for my man when he gets back home.
Tana. Alright, welcome home. anymore. Luis, I won't fight with you anymore, I promise. Okay, baby? difficult for me to keep loving you. Please. Please, we can fix this. Please, we're a couple. We I'm can fix sorry. I... I'm deeply sorry. Uh, we're not meant to be uh, together. Uh, 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 I know someday, someday soon, you will find someone who would, who would love and cherish you more than I ever did. Please, I trust that you, please. 